The OLED monitor market is getting hotter by the day and one of the latest additions is the ASUS ROG Swift OLED PG27AQDM. This monitor is a powerhouse boasting a 240Hz refresh rate, superb image quality and high build quality, all for $1,000. But as with any product, there are a few downsides to consider. In this video, we'll be taking a balanced look at the pros and cons of this monitor to help you decide if it's the right fit for you. So, if you're on the hunt for a new monitor, stick around and let's weigh the options together. And if you enjoy this type of content, make sure to hit that like button. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Specs, the ASUS ROG Swift OLED PG27 AQDM monitor, which boasts a 26.5-inch OLED panel that delivers an exceptional visual experience. The display is the second most popular size on the market, making it an ideal choice for those seeking a primary monitor for their desk. Its 240Hz refresh rate and HDR10 capabilities make it perfect for gamers and content creators alike. Plus, with adaptive sync and a range of stand adjustments, it's customizable to your specific needs. But let's talk about the elephant in the room, the price tag. At nearly $1,000, it's certainly not cheap. However, it's comparable to other OLED monitors on the market like the LG Ultraigure 27GR95QEB and Acer X27U. And with demand currently high, it's unlikely that the price will drop until later in the year. Design The Asus ROG Swift OLED PG27 AQDM design is a signature of the Republic of Gamers brand. While the sharp lines and muscular patterns may not be to everyone's taste, Asus deserves credit for creating a distinctive and recognizable look. The monitor's thin OLED panel is highlighted by the minimalistic metal and glass design, with the electronics consolidated into a box at the rear of the panel. The stand is a broad, angular unit that is both sturdy and attractive. The built-in customizable LED lighting adds to the visual appeal. Although it may be too bright for some users, the stand takes up a significant amount of desk space, which may be a concern for those with limited space. However, the included VESA mount adapter allows for the use of third-party monitor stands and arms. Features The ASUS ROG Swift OLED PG27 AQDM connectivity may be a bit underwhelming for some users. It only has two HDMI 2.0 ports and one DisplayPort 1.4, with the HDMI ports limited to 120Hz. While this won't be an issue for console gamers, it may be a problem for those with multiple PCs. Additionally, USB connectivity is limited to just two USB-A downstream ports driven by a USB-B upstream port, with no USB-C available. However, Asus more than makes up for it with the menu system. The PG27 AQDM offers a variety of color modes, including its sRGB mode and color customization options, such as color temperature, gamma, and six-axis color calibration. It also includes gamer-centric features, such as a black stabilizer and an on-screen crosshair. Asus goes above and beyond with two unique features not seen on most competitive monitors. The first is the uniform brightness setting, which overrides the standard brightness setting in SDR content. This eliminates the issue of brightness fluctuations when bright objects appear on screen. The second is an HER brightness override, allowing users to adjust brightness in HER mode. While this may come at the expense of image quality, it's a welcome addition for those who have struggled with brightness control on other HER monitors. Unfortunately, the PG27 AQDM doesn't include any speakers. This isn't unexpected as high-end monitors are typically less likely to have built-in speakers than less expensive models. Users will need to use a headset or standalone desktop speakers for audio. Image quality The Asus ROG Swift OLED PG27 AQDM is a monitor that boasts HER capabilities, but surprisingly, it doesn't have a VESA Display DR400 True Black certification. While its overall HER performance is good, it still has some of the typical OLED monitor pitfalls. One of these is its maximum full screen sustained HER brightness of just 186 nits. This may seem low, but it's a result of the test images used and the length of time displayed. On a 10% window, the monitor can reach a brightness of up to 611 nits, which is impressive for an OLED monitor. However, it still falls short compared to many LED monitors like the AOC Aegon ProAd 274QZM, which can reach almost 1000 nits. Despite its mediocre brightness, the PG27 AQDM has excellent contrast, which is one of the main strengths of OLED monitors. Its ability to deliver a perfect black level enhances the brightness and boosts the vibrance of the image. It also doesn't suffer from the blooming problem often found in many LED monitors. Instead, each pixel is independently lit, resulting in a more precise and detailed image. 
The PG27 AQDM has issues in the Windows desktop environment as colors can appear off-kilter and lack luminance detail. However, Asus has released a firmware update to improve color in HDR, which does help, but there's still room for improvement. For now, it's recommended to turn HDR off in Windows settings and only selectively turn it on within apps when possible. Overall, the PG27 AQDM HDR performance isn't perfect, but it does provide an advantage over SDR and is slightly better than QGIO LED monitors like the Alienware AW34 to 23 DWF and Corsair Xenon Flex. If AGR is your priority, it's recommended to go for a mini LED monitor instead. However, the PG27 AQDM still holds its own in darker games and movies. And that concludes our in-depth review of the Asus ROG Swift OLED PG27 AQDM monitor. We've covered everything from its stunning OLED display to its connectivity and HDR capabilities. So the big question is, will you be purchasing this monitor? It certainly has its strengths, such as excellent contrast and a uniform brightness setting that eliminates the problem of unstable brightness in SDR content. However, it also has some drawbacks such as limited connectivity options and mediocre brightness levels for HDR content. If you prioritize HDR and need a monitor that can deliver bright, vibrant images, you may want to consider a mini LED monitor instead. However, if you're a gamer or creator who values excellent contrast and deep blacks, the PG27 AQDM is certainly worth considering. If you have any further questions about this monitor or any other products, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up on your way out. We'll catch you in the next one.